Rancho Palos Verdes is a jewel on the coastline, a city that garners breathtaking views, miles of open space, and landmarks that attract the world. One of the most recognizable landmarks is the Point Vicente Lighthouse, which stands tall along the bluffs and is a true symbol of the peninsula. The lighthouse was built in 1926 and is operated by the Coast Guard and is on the National Registry of Historic Places. Next to the lighthouse is the Point Vicente Interpretive Center. People come from near and far to watch the migration of the gray whale. I have been a docent for 20 years, so I've seen lots of changes, and it is definitely the most wonderful place on the peninsula. Just across the shore from the Palos Verdes Interpretive Center sits the Terranere Resort, which reflects the beauty and history of the land in Rancho Palos Verdes. There were many, many architectural drawings and we really looked at how the land kind of cascaded down. We feel privileged to be on this site in this land and we're part of a broader community. Everyone's welcome and they can walk the pathways and feel like this is really their property. And before the spectacular property was Terranea, it was another treasure in the community called Marine Land. We were actually startled at how many people were involved with Marine Land over the years. I'm so grateful that I get to come here every day and serve um, this beautiful community and our guests. Not far from Terranea and nestled in nature is the world famous Wayfarers Chapel built in 1951 by architect Lloyd Wright. The Wayfarers Chapel is a Swedenborgen chapel and people come from all over the world to get married here and marvel at the unique architecture. Across the road from the Wayfarers Chapel is Abalone Cove Shoreline Park. It's one of nearly 20 parks run by the city. Abalone Cove, or Ab Cove, has two beaches, tide pools, hiking trails, and picnic areas along the bluffs. No matter what park you visit in RPV, you will find beautiful nature surrounding you. And just down the road at Trump National Golf Course is Founders Park and Marilyn Ryan Sunset Park, which have spectacular views. And speaking of spectacular views, you won't find a golf course anywhere that's as stunning as the views from Trump National Golf Club. Every single hole is either on the ocean or a view of the ocean, and there's no course like that in California. The city has been really spectacular. I mean, they want this to be the best. They're very proud of it, and we appreciate that, and we've really had a great relationship with them. The Palos Verdes Peninsula Land Conservancy has enjoyed a long-time collaboration with the city of Rancho Palos Verdes, working together to preserve this wonderful open space, which is the 1,400-acre Palos Verdes Nature Preserve. This is such a community treasure and landmark. It has amazing trails running through it with great habitat, wonderful scenic vistas, and lovely wildlife. No matter where you are in Rancho Palos Verdes, the landscape shines brightly. There are cultural and architectural wonders to see, businesses, schools and institutions to enjoy, and a treasure-filled community to celebrate. We congratulate um, the city on their 40-year anniversary. We're very happy to be part of their celebration.